Doma arigato to those people who watch my Autoke episodes. If you miss some videos, just go to the video section of my YouTube page. Love, B. Ohayou gozaimasu! Our Tokyo episode will explore for something delicious today. While walking, we pass by the gate by Her Highness Princess Masako, the Crown Princess of Japan. The Prime Minister of Japan is the head of government of Japan appointed by the Emperor. Then while we continuously walking, our jaw dropped and widely opened our eyes because of this. A sports car by McLaren. Look how wonderful the back engine is. You know, I cannot get out of here without even experiencing to sit down. <laughs> okay, McLaren, I'll come back to you. We're just going to eat something, okay? We continue to walk and look for the restaurant. I recommend you you using Google Map. It's very useful, and especially in Japan. Do you have a reservation? Yes. Kobe Beef Kaisaki 511. It is an ultimate area of Akasaka, one of the major business districts in Tokyo. The restaurant goal is to showcase Kobe beef around the world. The restaurant is particular about the quality of a Namesake beef. For me, I choose 511 meal set and 100 grams Kobe beef steak, medium rare. Thank you, it means Japanese beef. I know, this is from Prefectura Kobe. Yes, from Kobe. Yes, yes. Using only the choicest cuts of the highest A5 grade beef that has scored 11 on the BMS, beef marbling score for Kobe beef, the restaurant's executive chef carefully hand select the meat to be served at the beef market in Kobe. Wagyu beef. Kobe beef. This is the Kobe beef. Mm. Very, very, very delicious, tender, so bad. This is the perfect example of the marbling. Meaning to say, when you eat it, the fat surrounds entire steak. If you have a good beef, this will definitely melt in your mouth smoothly. Japan offers extraordinary bottle drink, and this one really tastes great. The Coca-Cola Peach. Shinjuku. As we continue to explore the great weather on the city, we're looking for some adventure. Not this kind of adventure, uh-uh. Maybe this one? But we found something great. Veer Zone Shinjuku. You need to pay 800 yen for the entrance, and you need to pay additional price for the VR experience, so you can either pay one attraction or all-in-one experience if you like.
conveyor belt sushi. Yan, kakain na naman kami ulit. Here we are again. Ayan, ito yung red light district ng Tokyo. Ayan, may mga club. Robot restaurant. Oh, this is the robot restaurant. Domo arigato, Mr. Robot Robot Restaurant is a unique entertainment experience in Japan. Japanese culture meets robots and bring you a new world of entertainment. Anyone from adults to children can come and enjoy the amazing show. The show is approximately around 19 minutes. Last stop, Yona Yona Beer Works. This is a Yoho Brings official beer bar in Tokyo. Since the first bar opened in Akasaka, its popularity led to a quick expansion with the new branches in Kanda, Ayoyama, and Kichi Doji. Nice. It's not that strong. Sa mga may galit, pag kumakain, hindi kayo pwedeng pumunta dito kasi mga knife na dito lang, magpapatayang kayo pwede. Ayan, daming knife. So in English, if you're eating with your enemy, don't go here de, because you'll kill each other with the knife. <laughs> Thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe for more of my videos. Thank you. Arigato!